Fern Britton opened up on her TV career and now enjoying life as a best-selling author during an appearance on the podcast Postcards from Midlife with Trish and Lorraine. However, as Fern was pressed on her illustrious career in television, she shared a shocking story with one of her former, difficult TV co-stars who, didn't like, the former This Morning host. Fern was asked by Lorraine Candy and Trish Halpin what it was like to work in what was a male-dominated industry. They remarked, it's fascinating to hear some of the behind-the-scenes stuff that goes on because it's all so glossy and smooth when you watch it on screen but there's all this stuff going on in the background. You worked with some of the biggest male names in TV like Philip Schofield, Bradley Walsh, Matthew Kelly, Frank Bow, Des Lynham, even Ronnie Corbett. But that probably presents its own challenges when you're working with huge personalities. You're having to work around them and maybe navigate that dynamic and that relationship. How did you find that? Fern replied, I didn't even address it actually. There's an awful lot you can engage with and get yourself anxious for no reason at all. I would just think, no I know who I am and what I'm doing and I know how to do this job. The best thing is just to be nice and make it easy and not panicky, she continued. I've always said this and I heard once from a woman who said, never look as if you are nervous because generally in those days the program would have been run by men and there would be men in the studio and if you look a little bit nervous about something or need a question answered they'll immediately think you are panicking, you're obviously hysterical and it would be handed to the man. All those men I worked with Eamon Holmes, all sorts of lovely people. However, Fern admitted some of her TV co-stars were better than others. Eamon's a dream, she quipped. Frank Bow was difficult. She went on to recall an uncomfortable encounter before pointing out Frank had told the story himself, before he died. When I joined Breakfast Time in 1982, 1983 I was the news reader or the presenter with Frank. So I was the stand-in whenever anybody was off I would stand in so I would present the program with Frank. Fern admitted Frank didn't like her and confessed he wasn't friendly towards her. She recalled being taken out for lunch by the breakfast time team and Frank telling her, I wonder how long it'll be before I'm having an affair with you because I do have a very big cock. The author claimed Frank really disliked her by the end of the time together on the program. 